The Executive Yuan's Economic Development Commission convened its first meeting on Thursday, presided by Premier Zhou Rongtai. The commission accomplished three key goals, including the approval of the National Development Plan, funded without, with trillions of NT dollars in domestic and foreign investment. It also approved a plan to turn Taiwan into an Asia, Asian Asset Management Center and an upgraded plan to nurture and attract talent to Taiwan. Let's hear from the commission. In the initial phase, we hope to attract 3 to 4 trillion NT in investment from domestic and foreign investors to put towards significant infrastructure projects and to develop major industries in Taiwan. We want to make Taiwan become an Asian asset management center with Taiwanese characteristics, and we plan to nurture 200,000 artificial intelligence professionals and attract 120,000 outstanding talents from overseas. Over the past few years, yield spreads have been too wide, and exchange rate fluctuations have been large. This has made foreign investments become less stable. So, insurance providers have been opting for safer investment targets domestically. The insurance industry's total investments overseas tally up to about 22 trillion NT, and about 3.27 trillion NT can be brought back in. Our goal is to use these 3.27 trillion NT to generate an economic impact of 10 trillion NT. The Commission aims to hire 40 to 50 experts from different fields of expertise as consultants and hold a meeting every quarter. The first advisory meeting is slated for August. At the gathering, the consultants will discuss the outcome of the discussion and offer their opinions on the relevant issues.